It's tough sledding tonight in parts of Montana, walloped by a very early snowstorm. And as Carter Evans reports, this first weekend of fall was more like the dead of winter. That's some crazy September snowfall, let me tell you. Today, the small town of Brownie, Montana is digging out. The early winter storm dumped a record breaking four feet of September snow here. Mario McCullough had to dig an escape route. So tell me what you're trying to do here. I'm trying to get in and out of the house. Just a week after the official end of summer, many in Montana woke up Saturday to winter. Most of the state was blasted with more than a foot of snow, forcing the governor to declare a state of emergency after thousands lost power. National Weather Service meteorologist Don Britton says the city of Great Falls, Montana, got more than 19 inches of snow. We've already broken the three-day record that was set in 1934. High winds and heavy snow down trees and covered roads, causing whiteout conditions, making driving treacherous. Lou Savick rode it out in the Red Cross shelter he was managing in town. Well, you didn't want to be out in it because hypothermia or frostbite. Some people can't open their doors to their houses. So much snow? Yeah. You can see how much snow we're talking about here. I'm buried up to my thighs in this front yard, and I'm told in this bump underneath the snow here is actually a car. The storm is over and the sun is shining, but they've still got a lot of digging out to do. Nora? A lot of digging out indeed, Carter. Thank you so much.